Hi guys, in many travel videos created by professional photographers, the building grow effect could be spotted very often. But can an ordinary person replicate a similar effect? The answer is of course yes. And in today's video, we will show you an easy way to achieve this effect and add it into your own videos. And without further ado, let's get the video started. First, let's launch Video Vlogger and create a new project. Import prepared architecture footage into the software. It's best if the footage has a fixed camera angle as it will make the editing process easier. Drag the footage onto the video track. Find the camera icon in the preview window and click it to capture the corner frame. Now, we go to the image extraction website and I will put a website link in the description box down below and you can go check it out if you need. Drag and drop the captured frame onto the website which will automatically remove the sky background for you. Next, we click the editing button and continue to erase any other unwanted parts. You can adjust brush size and view size for detailed areas. This way, you will obtain a clean architectural image. Once you have extracted upper half of the building, click Download to save the image. Use the same method to extract the remaining two parts of the building. Let's move to another website to replace the sky with AI technology. Well, we have explained how to use this website in detail in a previous video. If you don't know how, you can click the link in the upper right to check it out. Use this tool to remove the building from the image and input sky to generate a new image with complete sky but no buildings. Then, we import all this image into video vlogger. And there we complete the preparation process. First, find this icon in the interface and click it to add several overlay tracks. Drag the AI sky replacement image to one of the overlay tracks. Adjust the duration of each image to ensure they align properly. Then, in the inspector panel, click hide to make it fit to the screen. Click the crop icon in the toolbar and crop the upper half of the frame in the new window. Click Apply to apply the adjustment. Then, click the Show or Hide Layer Rectangle button to align it with the frame. Once you've done that, drag the three extracted architectural image and put them into separate overlay tracks. Adjust the size to cover the entire frame. Then, adjust their appearing and ending times to create a sequential order. Now, you can start creating the growing animation. Select the one image, find the motion icon in the toolbar, and click it to enter the motion editor panel. Click Add Keyframe at the first frame and adjust the frame to select the building area. Move the playhead forward and click Add Keyframe again. Choose a speed curve for this keyframe to make the motion smoother. Then select the first keyframe and move the frame slightly upward. Don't forget to click Add Keyframe at the last frame to maintain the final state of the motion. Preview the animation. Click Apply to return to the main interface and adjust position in the preview window. Use 
use the same method to edit the growth animation for the other two parts of the building. After completing all the edits, import a sound effect for the growth animation and place it on the audio track. Add the sound effect based on the rhythm of the building growth. And add a fade effect. And that's it. Alright, that's all for today's video. You can try the growing effect in all videos. And if there's any other content you'd like to see, don't forget to leave us a comment down below. And we'll see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye!